Here we have Mothership and what we're announcing here at Computex 2019 is that we're using liquid metal. Thermal Grizzly liquid metal, um, we have it right here. We've been working with them for a while. It took us around two years to figure out how to apply liquid metal in an assembly line in a way that it's applied really well, repeatedly at every, on every system without any issues and also to make sure that it doesn't escape the CPU socket. So we have a special rubber ring around it. We developed our own robot that applies the liquid metal the right quantity in the right location. As you all know, it's difficult to apply liquid metal on a CPU. So that took a while, but it was really worth it because you can see here we have one with liquid metal and one with regular thermal paste and the temperature difference is around 15 degrees. On average, when you're playing games, you get 15 degrees lower temperatures, 300 to 400 megahertz higher CPU clock speeds, and because the temperature is lower, the fan spin lower, so it's quieter as well. So it's really a huge difference of the one with liquid metal versus the one without liquid metal. So what we're showing here is Prime 95. So we have 100% CPU load, as you can see here. And uh, you can see the average CPU temperature, we're getting around 70, 73, which is really low. Um, over here, this is the one with traditional thermal paste, the regular thermal paste, same thing, Prime 95. It looks different, but that's because this one has a full HD panel and that one has a 4K panel. And the scaling of apps in Windows, you know. Um, here we see average temperatures around 85, 89, so let's say 87 on average. This one is around 72 on average. So you can see that's like a 15 degrees difference, higher than 15 degrees difference.